If you feel children, and a typically developing child, you'll feel a child that's totally tonified. You feel a system that's alive, that it moves in it, it, it wants to go somewhere. So it's definitely not a passive interaction in any kind of a way. You're interacting with the system that if you know where it's going to go to or where you want to go, they're the one that does it. Oh, now you're totally tonified. Keep it here. Look, he gets himself totally tonified here. If he'd keep this, he'd be able to, to rock back and forth. We started to deal more with tone, okay? Tonification and the use of tone, how to recognize how tone needs to be developed, how it's used, different changes in the tone or different aspects of, of tone. Keep it up and she'll use her back. Look, she tonifies all through the back, what? Exactly. And return, yeah, feel just that and that and that and that, you feel? Gets you up. And you can raise the tone higher and you can lower the tone just for any uh, individual. Even strong here, look, I can get a good tone. And then I can say, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it. And the child has to automatically, has to raise the tone. If they can raise the tone or the level of contraction, this is a very wonderful thing. That's it. Oh, look at the position. Now let's see. Come. That's better. Come. Yeah. Excellent. That's it. That's it. That, ah, that's good. That's good. Now watch his head. Where is it tonified to everybody? That's good. Great. Yeah? Can you see where the head gets tonified to, to the left? It's important when we work with the special needs children that depending on the types of, uh, uh, of situations that they have, to know, oh, are you looking to get a normal, is that what you're thinking? I'm going to get a normal tone of the muscle. Okay? That's it. And let's get your spiny. Could you feel the tone? Excellent. And you put up. Good. That's it. That's it. Now that's a way to keep a head tonified. Look, in the flexor. Great. Hop, 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 hop. Excellent. Hop, hop. Hey, that's good. Hoppa, hoppa. Go back. Bravo. Excellent. Fantastic. Fantastic. Ravi Simono. Now, that's it. Now, will you go over? You only want to go over now, huh? Look. Yeah. And come back. Other side. Other side. Hand. Hand. That's it. Bravo. And now roll. That's it. Get your head down and you're on your back. Now, who says you don't learn to sit by sitting? So, I think this is a very good example to see what was done in the sitting, the use of the balance the perturbation of the balance in terms of it, him being able to pull himself back, okay? This was a lot of work for the child, but he was ready to be challenged, he keeps his mood, and then you saw the results in the end of the hands going down, very strong on the hands, and you could feel so strong in the arms, it was unbelievable.